guys, welcome back to Makeup by Aaron. Obviously I am Aaron. Today I'm going to do kind of like a chit chat review with you. So grab your coffee or your tea, whatever you drink. I drink coffee, well I drink cappuccino personally in my uniform. Right? Quite fitting really. Sippy. I won't do sippy sippy because that's quite a good girl and that's just really weird. Just so. Anyway. So. The product we're going to review, obviously you know because you clicked on this video or you can see it in the title down below. It is the Unicorn Heart uh, Rainbow Highlighter. Now I like what this is, it says made by Unicorn so that's quite funny to me. So I've been looking for this product for months on end, like right, in the shops where Makeup Revolution is sold. Now for us that's uh, sold in Superdrug but you can buy it online. Now, my husband bought me this one and I'm so grateful and oh my god, basically when he gave it to me I was like shocked. I didn't really like to pay attention to it, but it's one of the things that like game and stuff. Uh, yeah, so let's get through to this review and kind of like an unboxing. I've opened it to have a look because you know when you get something like this it's so exciting. So here's the unboxing, it is amazing. I'm just saying I love the packaging. And yeah, so basically comes like that and it's a shape of a heart obviously it tells you everything on the back so the gold packaging so it says it's made by unicorns and under the license for Tam Beauty which is a collective of makeup companies I'm pretty sure they do uh, Freedom Makeup they do I Heart Makeup Makeup Revolution are in with that group as well on their site so keep that in mind okay so, I'm going to give you the reveal on screen actually. I quite like the foil, uh, it, it's kind of like iridescent foil, I don't know if it picks up on in this light, but there you go. So, here we go. Now, I don't know if that's focused on that. There is a lot of colour payoff from this. That was just literally one strike, see? Now, what I will do, on the back of my hand, I'm going to transfer it. So I've gone from that to that, so that's a second transfer and here's the rubbing in. It's all over my hands. So yeah, I think that looks pretty. You can see all the colours, you've got the purple, the blue, the green, the yellows and all that. You can see all the colours distinctly, okay? I'm going to now apply it to my face. Now normally, I would use one of these, but... <laughs> I'm going to grab something I haven't used yet because I don't really want to stain them but I think it's quite fitting that I try to test them out on this video Unicorn brushes Now in here they have a fan brush Right there Yay! I don't really want to use them, they're pure white but For this, I suppose, I can do it So this is a really quality, it's like quite a dense fan brush so I'm quite shocked by that what I'm going to do is I'm just going to grab a couple of swipes of that so it does transfer onto the brush like this and I'm going to apply that to my face, okay? Now that is just literally applying from the brush to the face just like this and then just giving it a blend over and I, I think that's amazing on my skin tone I'm just taking a little bit just to go up so yeah, I, I, I really do think this is a nice product. You could probably just select a specific colour. To be fair, I'm not going to because at the end of the day, if I'm going to use a Unicorn Heart Highlighter, the card's jump that in. I mean, obviously I haven't got makeup on, so it's going to probably look different when I do makeup. But the makeup I want to do is a Unicorn makeup look. So. I'll use this, I'm going to use all the products, that's basically unicorn, so I'm going to use these brushes, this product, I've got a wig set up, I need to get a horn, uh, that looks a bit, oh no it's not, it's just me, anyway, because it's twisted, these are really nice brushes anyway, uh, yeah, so what I'm going to do to see if I can pick up a solid swipe of that, this looks like one of the brushes that I'm going to say Jeffree Star would use, like a fluffy highlighter brush, now, not that big so I'm not going to be able to get much of a colour payoff so I've just gone with the purple, the green and the blue and I've taken two swipes. There's a lot of fallout on that but I just picked it up onto the brush. 
I'm gonna go this side. Now, uh, yeah, I'm gonna just sweep, see if it picks up. So you could go quite a cold, icy shade with that. It's quite nice. But I would say the blue and the purple are the more overpowering colours to the rest. So bear that in mind when planning a makeup look, you want, if you're gonna do a warm tone makeup, try aiming for like the red and the yellow. Again, I'm just gonna try and pick that up on the brush, see? Like that, and I dare say if he was to, I'm gonna do it on my forehead for you. There you go, yes. So it gives you more of a golden tone if you use those two colors rather than try and get the greens, the blues and the purples because they give you a colder tone. So say you was gonna do a summer look with bright colors, use a golden color, the two end ones. Cooler tones like dark purples, dark greens and blues and that are perfect for the corner end of the heart, okay? So you've got like, what's that? You've got five color uh, highlighters in one, so I love that. The price of it when it first came out was five pound, okay? Now, I was okay with that. And then a couple of months down the road, it got, so I'm pretty sure it got switched to 10, because that's how much it costs now. And I, don't quote me on it because I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it was a five when I first went to get it. But yeah, anyway. So the price of that is a tenner. Do I think it's worth it? I'm someone that doesn't like to spend money on pro uh, makeup looks. So as a collector, yes, because it's something you want in your kit. As uh, someone who would do makeup just to wipe it off, no, because I'm not getting any beneficial use from that. As an everyday person who wears makeup and loves the fun side of makeup, go for it. Do you know what I'm saying? All in all, it is an amazing colour play of products and I have no thoughts with it. So, two thumbs up for me. Anyway, leave me a comment, let me know if you want more. And yeah, and if you buy the product, let me know and see what you think. And until next video, have fun, be creative, and remember, makeup washes off. Enjoy yourselves, and I'll see you soon.